Okay, alarm sprinkler system will not respond to the timer's controls. Single pane. Water damage from the attic gable window light. This window will blow out during a fire in the garage. These windows will blow out during a fire in the garage. This door should also, if you have, once you get the proper door in here, should have a self-closing spring. The control buttons for the door openers are high enough. There should be a warning notice posted on the doors. This is how we test the optic sensors. Okay, I've made a business decision, business decision to do no harm. Okay, so I checked it with the... I have instructions on how to do a block test baked into the inspection report. And maybe one of the listing agents can show us how that works. What's that water doing here? Is that old? Is that oil or something? Okay. Now on our doors, we're supposed to have spring tension notices and pull handles on the bottom corners of the doors and the insides of the doors. We're supposed to have pull handles. We do not have a pull handle on the smaller door. And we are missing one of our spring tension notices on the smaller door. Our manual door locks should have been, and we should have a pull handle on this door. This door has a pull handle, has stickers on both sides. This door doesn't have a pull handle, it's only got a sticker on one side. Our manual door locks have not been decommissioned. We do not have warning notices posted on the insides of the doors like we don't have warning notices posted there. Our doors are not on GFCI. Our courtesy lights are working. Let's see if the doors are in adjustment. I got a pull handle on this one somewhere. We call it a pull handle. Okay, spring is adjusted properly. How are we doing over here? Oh. <laughs> There we go. Come on down. So our doors are in pretty good shape, okay? All we're really missing here is a pull handle and some safety notices.